Hey, what's up, people? My name is Fernando, and welcome back to the channel. We're a single player, you know, just chilling. I'm playing as CJ from San Andreas, and today's video, I will be showcasing something very, very interesting. Now, we went ahead and, you know, upgraded Franklin's house. Now, I know what you're saying, dudes. I know exactly what you're thinking. Fernando, wh 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 what are you talking about? What's all this foolishness that's coming out your mouth, man? What do you mean you upgraded Franklin's house, dude? Well, as you people can see right in front of us, this is Franklin's new house. And basically what we went ahead and did was modify and upgrade all the stuff inside his, you know, crib right here to make it a little bit more interesting looking. So today's video, I will be giving you guys a full tour of this place because this basically brings a bunch of brand new stuff that wasn't originally added to Franklin's house to give it a more improved look. So we're gonna go in and be doing that, man. And before we get things started today, dude, I was just wondering if you people can help me out by dropping down a blue thumbs up in today's video. It literally takes about one or two seconds of your day. And if we can try to get this video to over 69 blue thumbs up, then you guys will be the true MVPs, dude. I will fucking love you people all forever, man. And as well, subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new. I would hate it if you missed out any of my brand new videos. But with that being said, let's get things started today, dudes. Alrighty, people. So as you can see, this is the front of Franklin's house. So like I said in the beginning of the video, people, we will be doing a full tour of this humongous place right here because there is so much stuff that I got to cover and hopefully you guys will go ahead and love this because I thought this was absolutely mad, dude. So entering inside Franklin's house, you guys can see a bunch of stuff that hasn't been here originally. And like I said before, this place is absolutely insane, dude. Like there's so much cool things that I wish Rockstar gave us the ability to actually go ahead and customize. But unfortunately, they don't do that. So I got to go ahead and uh, showcase this to you people. Starting off, we can see some big old posters or pictures paintings of some very cool looking stuff to make the place look a little bit more better we also got this motorcycle right here and this beautiful vehicle and as well we're gonna be moving on towards here so as you people can see right about there we got some guitars we got some movie posters we also got like a little dj set right there and we also got some very very attractive uh women uh posing for daddy franklin right about here and some cool looking posters that really do make the place look a little bit more livelier and as well when we move on towards here we're gonna be going towards the kitchen now basically if you guys haven't figured it out already this mod adds a bunch of stuff towards franklin's house to make it cool so since this place doesn't really get that much you know attention and it's not really that popular i gotta go ahead and download the mod to showcase this to you people because you know there's so many cool people out there that actually do make some very interesting mods for this game so i thought i'd go ahead and showcase one of the best ones for franklin's house that i found very interesting now since we showcase all about this stuff right here there's also one huge thing in the backyard we also got a freaking party going on right about there and don't worry dudes we're gonna be going back there and enjoying the party with all these folks but before we do let's go ahead and head downstairs here we got this beautiful painting a clock and we're gonna be moving on towards Franklin's bedroom all right so look at this boys look at this we got we, we got we got Franklin miss miss Franklin right here ch chillaxing I'm not sure if this is the same bitch on the fucking painting right there Maybe it is, I'm not too sure, but she got nice titties though. I ain't complaining on that, dude. I ain't complaining about that. We also got this very cool looking uh thing on the wall right there. I believe this is from the Easter egg, but it's painted over towards this to make it look a little bit more cool looking. We also got Franklin's gaming PC right about here, chillaxing. He also got the little laptop when he has to go out to PAX or E3 when he's chillaxing over there, dude. But other than that, let's do like a quick little overview of the whole place itself because I want to go ahead and cover as much ground as possible before we end things here. So in the closet, you guys can see that Franklin's armory is right about there. We got a katana. What? I wish this thing was in the game originally. We also got all this cool stuff right about here to make the closet look, you know, a little bit more interesting looking. As well, we got gold. We got money, suitcases, all this type of stuff. It kind of reminds me of the, you know, apartments in the game that you guys can become a CEO and have all your cash just like loitering around in the freaking crib right there. Looks pretty cool. 
And that pretty much does it. We're going to be moving on forward towards the hallway. And there we got Mr. Franklin, you know, employee of the month. Looks pretty cool. And here you guys can see a jukebox. We got some alcohol right about there. Some gold. And I believe that pretty much does it for all the way here. I'm not too sure if you guys can enter all this. Let's see. Nope. Can't enter it. And that pretty much does it, boys. So how about we go ahead and you know enjoy the party that's going on in the backyard and there is like a freaking huge mungus load of people out there I i'm not too sure maybe i scared them away when i went ahead and killed a few of them who were pissing me off so yeah let's go ahead and head towards there all right people so here we are as you can see from the deck we got so many cool looking things here we got burger shop we got we got juice cups we got a big old table from, you know, the DLC. I'm not too fucking sure, dude. We got barbecue set. And we got all these people moonwalking their way out of my crib. So that's pretty cute. And originally, I guess that these people are supposed to be partying. I guess some of them got spooked and they're trying to run away. But no problem, dude. We're going to be moving on forward and ignoring all that foolishness. So this little thing right there leads us towards the roof of franklin's house we got these party people just cheering up and they're all hyped dude they're all hyped here's the little bartender place right about here where you guys can get your drink game on and we're gonna be moving on forward towards here oh i didn't know like there's like a little catwalk here that's pretty cool and moving on there is the roof of franklin's um let's see dude mm, this looks pretty interesting Pretty cool, pretty cool. And I think that pretty much does it for the roof right about here. Oh, wait. Hold on. Hold on. We got my best friends. We got Franklin's best friends here chillaxing as well. We can't forget about them, dude. If I can uh, escape from here. All right. What's up, party people? What's up? We got Lamar, Michael, Franklin. What's up, baby? What's up? How you people doing today? I wonder if I transform into another single player character, I would transform into, you know, one of them right here. I'm not too sure. It's a mod. I, I don't know how these things work. And I guess like this little office place where these people uh, plan out their heist missions and stuff, which does look very, very unique looking. And then now we're going to be going downstairs and checking out what exactly is right about here. So as people can see, this place adds a freaking pool party to the backyard of Franklin's house. Of course, there's not much things that you can do here originally, but with the mod itself, we can go ahead and, uh, you know, get our groove game on, dude. Now, we got pool tables, we got a basketball thingy-majigger right here, we got, uh, what's this, air hockey, we got the game machine, and a lot of cool stuff, dude. Like, I wish Rockstar did give us the ability to customize our apartments or mansions and all that type of stuff. Because I guess the game will be a little bit more different and unique looking when we enter our friends' houses and stuff. Instead of it all being the same exact house and stuff. So, I don't know, dude. I just thought that would be a pretty cool idea that Rockstar can actually go ahead and implement. Now, right about here, you guys can see the pool. You can see the TV set right about here. Just chillaxing for Franklin. And we also got these random people just uh, just sitting there not watching nothing. But other than that, that pretty much does it for all this type of stuff right here. I got to say, I, check out the mod people. I'll link it down below. You guys can do a humongous tour around here just in case you want to review the place a little bit more longer. But I guess we're going to be wrapping things up right about here, dude. I don't know. Let me know if down below in the comments if you guys thought this mod was pretty cool or shit. I'm not, I, I don't know, dude. You guys are really weird. But let me know down below, like I said before. So I guess right about now, I'm going to go ahead and remove all the stuff right about here. For you guys can go ahead and see how much of a difference this actually goes ahead and do. But here is the overview of the whole place itself. Adds a bunch of stuff, like I said, and it does make the place look a little bit more unique looking. But other than that, let's go ahead and remove it to see what exactly we do lose. So let me go ahead and load this up right about here. Go ahead and put new map. And bam, just like that, everything is gone. Now we got Franklin's old plain looking house. Does look very sad. But I guess that's the price we have to pay when Rockstar doesn't give us customization on our apartments. 
But I guess that pretty much does it for today's video, and I really do hope that you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you support the video with a blue thumbs up. I would appreciate it ever so much, and you guys would be doing me ever so great to my channel. And as well, subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new. I would hate it if you missed out any of my brand new videos. But with that being said, I'll see you guys later, and peace.